Mortal Kombat 2 writer confirms Johnny Cage is unsure how much she'll be included. Let's take a look. Johnny Cage did not appear in last year's Mortal Kombat movie, but the movie conclusion made it clear that the character would be appearing in the sequel. At the end of the movie, Louis Tan's Cole Young heads to LA to recruit the movie star for the next tournament. In a new interview with comicbook.com, Mortal Kombat 2's writer Jeremy Slater was asked about Johnny Cage's story in the sequel. While Slater is not sure how much emphasis the film will place on Cage, the writer is hoping to bring a definite version of the character to the base screen. Johnny Cage is one of my favorite characters, and I think there's definitely a promise with the way the first movie ends of seeing Cole's being like, okay, my next stop is go recruit Johnny. So I think if he wasn't included in the sequel at all, it would feel very strange, said Slayer. It's still a bit up in the air how much he will be included. It's one of the things we're currently working on, but yeah, I love Johnny and I would love to really do a definite version if possible and really take everything that's fun about the character and bring it that to live action. Johnny was absent from last year's film, but he played a key role in the 95 movie where he was portrayed by Leonard Ashby. After all these years, Ashby remains one of the most memorable parts of the movie acting as a strong source of comic relief. New Line Cinema has not cast an actor in the role for Mortal Kombat 2, though fans have potential for The Miz as well as Ryan Reynolds. Now, for the casting part, I don't see The Miz or Ryan Reynolds playing Johnny Cage, but the person who is the perfect candidate, who is the perfect choice for Johnny Cage is Alan Mousy, and I'm gonna continue to stand my ground on that, I think. He is the perfect choice for the role. He has looks. He's a great martial artist. And if he could just bring some comedic timing in the sequel, because Johnny Cage is a comic relief character. Now, if Alan were to play that role officially, I think it'll be something fans could just appreciate the character for being true to himself in the movie. Regardless of who plays the role, hopefully Slayer and New Line Cinema will deliver a sequel that expands on a previous film while also bringing in more elements from Mortal Kombat canon. For now, fans will just have to wait patiently to see what comes next. At the end of the day, we really don't know who's going to be cast as Johnny Cage. Whether it's Mez, Ryan Reynolds, Alan Mousy, but for me, my top choice is still Alan Mousy because he's the perfect choice for Johnny Cage. And I'm going to stand by if you watch his martial arts movies on Netflix, then you will know just how talented that brother is for the character. So if y'all want the article, I will post it in the description below. Until then, I'm out of here.